We are gradually learning more and more about an overnight officer involved shooting in Chickasaw County. Let's go live right now to WTVA's Garner Montgomery. He's in Okalona, just miles away from where that gunfire happened. So we started this day off knowing very little information other than a shooting happened last night near Oklahoma, just down this road, a few miles west of here. And right now we don't have a complete picture of what happened, but at least some of it is starting to come into focus. And first, I want to share with you these photos provided by the family of Cody Ernest. He's the man who died in the officer-involved shooting before 11 p.m. He says his niece... His niece says the shooting happened where Ernest lived. It's actually where he grew up. And now we want to give you an idea of where that shooting occurred. The Mississippi Bureau of Investigation says it was in the area of Highway 32, a few miles west of the city. The agency adds no officers were hurt and is looking into how law enforcement handled that situation. And that's common practice for the state to get the calls uh, calls to investigate such shootings. And we did reach out to Chickasaw County Sheriff Jim Myers to see if he wanted to share anything. He referred us to MBI. Uh, however, the niece of the man who died did talk to us and we'll share some of that conversation coming up at WTVA 9 News at 6. And for now, reporting live from Okalona, Garner Montgomery, WTVA 9 News.